People in Worcester finally had their chance to air concerns about Kelly Square. Mass DOT holding a workshop Wednesday addressing the safety and deficiencies at the city's most notorious intersection. Tonight, the department laid out a timeline hoping to get started on the project next year. Our Cam Jandro joins us now live from Kelly Square with more. Cam? That's right, Anna. We are in the notorious Kelly Square here in the city of Worcester. And Mass DOT, it's important to note they are yet to release a plan. They're still looking and weighing their options on how they're going to redesign Kelly Square. If you have a look behind me, you can see that there is traffic, not nearly as bad though, because it's 10 o'clock at night today. Mass DOT hearing from people who are in Kelly Square regularly. A look at Kelly Square during rush hour and drivers can understand why the state's Department of Transportation is taking public input on a redesign. Walking, driving, biking, uh, businesses, we want to see what some of those challenges are so we can try to incorporate those uh, in uh, our solutions to make it more efficient. The intersection will be redesigned as part of the deal to build a AAA baseball stadium nearby. Potential improvement ideas include traffic signals, geometric changes, a roundabout, or even changing the direction of the current streets. John Bouchard is the Deputy Chief Engineer for Project Development at Mass DOT. He says the state had eyes on this project before the city got the paw socks. Once we started looking collect collectively at all of the accidents in the area, it kind of bubbled up and said, look, this is something they all work together and they, we need to try and solve as many as we can and make it you know, safer for all users. Wednesday, people shared their thoughts and actually drew out possible solutions on maps of Kelly Square. You definitely need some type of coordination. So it, it's got a bad reputation for being a dangerous intersection, but it's not dangerous, it's congested. And it's a big difference. Some, like Worcester's Alan Fletcher, see the intersection as one of Worcester's signature features. Fletcher says it works well, but he knows he can't stop the redesign. What I'm dedicated to is making sure that it, we come out better after the redesign and not worse. Mass DOT is hoping to have a completed design by May of next year. They say they have a tight window knowing Boston's AAA affiliate is on its way. Baseball team's a factor that we're going to be, you know, incorporating into our traffic model. But, uh, you know, we're just trying to get things done as, as quickly and as efficiently as we can. Now, a few important dates to keep in mind. In January of 2019, Mass DOT wants to have 25% of this redesign completed. Again, in May of 2019, they would like to have the entire redesign completed, and they're hoping to break ground on construction here in Kelly Square in October of 2019, so about a year from now. We're live in Worcester tonight. I'm Cam Jandro, Worcester News Tonight.